So the first day spot here, you're gonna throw it from the lobby area to mini. You make sure to line this bit up together with this bit, aim it all the way up, and jump throw as a rifle. Goes over the wall, and it lands in the mini area. This is usually where people are either lining up their nades or getting ready to defend it, or people that are rushing into the mini. So you'll get a lot of nade spots with that. Keep in mind though that people can also throw a nade back from here, from this same spot, by lining up this pillar together with this bit of the wall up at the top of the building. So if you line those up and throw it back, you can do this without jumping, which means that a sniper or a pointman can jump. So you throw this, plants right back in the entrance. If you want to nade the inside of one, close to the stairs from outside here, or in front of the vent, you step inside of this tile, all the way in the middle, aim at the middle bit in between the first uh, on top stair, and then just throw the nade. This one's extremely difficult to do as a rifle. If you throw it well, you see it lands all the way down at the stairs, and people that are waiting here, either trying to get up, or trying to hold the stairs, they will get damaged or even killed by that grenade. If you want to make sure that you can nade the people outside from inside, you can also throw a nade back, step to the back of the wall, aim right about the middle of the entrance all the way on top of the roof, and you just throw the nade. This one goes outside. The where, where it lands doesn't really matter. You saw this one landed about here. Just make sure to throw it through. As long as it goes through the window, it will land somewhere outside here and it will do some damage. So it doesn't really matter where exactly it does land. If you want to nade the stairs, make sure that you clip this tile, look all the way up, aim for this edge of the roof, and just throw the grenade, bounces off, and lands in the door opening. The good thing is that it explodes right about the left side. So people are usually camping here at the left side trying to peek. They don't really go to the right side because they're exposed. So they'll stand over here, they'll stand over here. If they're camping over here, you nade them out. If they're standing a little bit further back, they still get naded out. Even further back, they'll get damaged. Spawn. You make sure to step up, crouch, aim for this bit, and then stand up, and then you can throw it. You can also jump through it with a pointman or a sniper. As you can see, it comes across. So snipers that are trying to hold the angle Usually they're not standing that close. They can. It's a good way to avoid it. Most snipers stand a little bit further to the back and they can hit you. I have a green smoke which lasts a little bit longer but you can do this with uh, a regular um, grey smoke as well. They recently added a new smoke that is, explodes on contact just like it does in CS Gold. This would be the preferred smoke for this nade spot. You can use this for executes. So you can so you stand all the way on the left. Make sure that you don't put yourself too visible because people will see you. You line all the way up to this edge of the roof, stand up and throw it. If we then go on, it lands right in front of the door. So snipers camping, they won't be able to see anything. If you want to nade the bomb site too, walk up, crouch down here, make sure to aim this nasty bit in the wall, draw it down. And then you throw it, bounces off, and it lands right on the bomb site, right where you want it. Need to aim lower. This might be it. Yeah, see, but uh, I'm not 